Life was like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Hey, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you my real-time trading. You will see how I find the entry points, how I open a trade, etc. I will explain all my decisions. So I hope this video will be useful for you. I already opened uh, currency pairs with 70 plus percent and I find a good moment to open a trade in a long position. So why do I think so? I see a really strong uptrend here. Really strong classic uptrend with strong impulses and rebounds. So right now we see that we are on a rebound. So I used the Fibonacci retracement tool to find the levels where rebound most likely will end and price will continue to go up. Of course, it might be a trend reverse, but probability of success when you open a trade by the trend is way bigger if you open a trade by expected trend reverse. And if you don't know what Fibonacci retracement does, leave a comment please. I will make a detailed video about this. But long story short, this is a tool that shows uh, potential support and resistance levels after a strong upward or downward movements. So you need to find a strong impulse on the graph, then select FIBO on your toolbar, click on the point when movement started and on the point when it ended. And then just hold and drag it to extend the lines. And you will get lines that might be your strong support or resistance levels. So here they are. Well, I think uh, we will see a breakout and strong upward movement here. And let me open a trade first. So why I think there will be a breakout? First of all, if we look at the key points where the price changed its direction, we will clearly see an absorption pattern that worked. A uh, quick explanation how absorption works. If you see that one candle has completely absorbed by the following candle, then there is a high probability that the next uh, few candles price will go in a direction of the dominant candle. We're also able to see it here and here. And right now we have this pattern as well. So first so this is the first argument to open a trade in a long position. Uh, the second argument is uh, domination of a bulls. So this is the level that price should break if my expectations are correct, of course. Uh, and I think there is a bull domination because I would say, okay, look, uh, this is the price that the chart went down to and at that price the chart started to move up strongly and the nearest similar points are here and here. As you can see these points appear on higher and higher price levels. So let me show you guys. And also look at the points. Uh, graph reached this level and then went down for a certain amount, right? And look at the similar point here and see the difference between these two downward movements. I believe that there will be a confident upward movement. There is a rule. If you see a candle that significantly larger than other candles, then the middle point of this candle is a very strong support or resistance level and uh, depends on the color of this candle. So in this case, we have a good level of resistance right here. And in addition to that level, there is another one on the chart and here it is. So my plan is if the price breaks the first resistance level and reaches the second one, then I will open a trade for 5 minutes in a short position. 
So let's wait for the right condition. This is a five minute time frame, so I think it will be clear in 15 minutes whether or not a trade can be opened here. It's a potentially very good situation, so I will wait. Well, <laughs> I kind of lost my opportunity. I was waiting for the price to go up uh, a little bit and I missed the opportunity to open a trade. I think a lot of people know this feeling, uh, so learn from my mistakes, don't be so perfectionist like me. It could be a really confident trade though. Okay, let's move on. Another interesting situation, a very strong uptrend and the price is at the highest point for the last few weeks. Uh, let's ask the Fibonacci to show us the levels. So what we have here, uh, so-called triangle pattern. We see a good level of resistance that the price will break soon. This is the moment when the volatility on the chart drops and the bulls seems to push the price to a level. And after volatility drops, there will always be a strong increase of volatility. In other words, there will be a breakout. The question is whether the price goes up or down. In this case, we have a really strong trend, so I expect that the price will go up. And here I see a big gap between two candles, so I believe the next candle will be red. And if it will be red, then the nearest point the price goes down to is this level, right? So by the time it happens, I will open a trade in a long position. But you know what's the difference between a good trader and bad trader? Uh, well, the good trader is learns from his mistakes. So I will open a trade right now. I will not wait till the price reaches the perfect level of Fibonacci. So I don't want to make same mistakes. I will open a trade right now. <clears throat> and one more thing. Let's imagine that you are opened the exact same deal in a long position and then the price rapidly went down. But you are very confident that the price will go up soon and you want to open more deals. Don't do that. Do not open any more deals because it's against money management. Your risk now is $100 and you don't need to increase it. If this deal will be out of the money, then next deal uh, you can double your trade amount, but not now. So don't rush, don't be too greedy, just wait till the trade is over. So guys, if you want to see more technical analysis, then feel free to join my Telegram channel where I give free trading signals. I explain each of my trades and posting the results so you can learn on my good trades as well as on my mistakes. And you also be able to copy my trades automatically. So if you are interested, just text me through any social media and I will add you. I hope you enjoyed this video and see you in the next one. Bye.